All right, guys, so the update just came out again. Um, it, it hasn't even been that long. It's only been like a couple weeks or something. So um, apparently how this new content is accessed is you go to your little character here and you just click this thing and then boom, there should be a character right here. And then see what he has to say. Uh, for some reason, his question mark thing is not pixelated, but I will not question it. Hello, I'm a virtual duck. There are 1,064 virtual coins remaining. Perhaps in the dirt racetrack, you shall find one. The coins will reset once every lunar interval, which, um, according to the internet, that is 29 and a half days. Nice. Also, you just gotta appreciate the fact that anytime I'm talking to someone now, I'm just, I'm just busting it. I'm just dancing. Oh yeah. Also, um, I'm not really gonna show much of this coin collecting because it's just, it's just going to different areas and collecting coins. Like this is what it looks like when you collect one. Just. And adds one coin to your inventory and then once you eventually collect all 1000 quite a lot um it will actually give you credit and you'll be able to access this new thingy and then they give you a good hint that's something that's really important if any of you want to beat this definitely use the hints those are important you yeah, see look here's some more coins oh wait what oh who's this guy hold on he looks a little strange um hello I can exchange your prize tickets for coins if you like, and then I'll give you 19,604. Holy crap, that is a lot. Um, dang. And then I get rid of all of them. Holy crap, that's actually pretty good. I mean, damn, I'll take it. All right, quick update. Um, basically, in conclusion, the rest of this grind wasn't very fun. There were a few occasions where I did not find them that quickly. What I'm talking about is that for the town, or not the town, for the port and the ski mountain ones, there are coins behind certain objects that you can't see. For example, the port one, there's buildings, and behind the buildings, there's coins. And then for the ski mountain in the racetrack area, there are coins behind the trees, and you can't see them. So that made me take way longer than I should have to find these. That's a little trick for you guys. Um, I recommend looking there because they stuck past me, and I thought the game was broken, but no, it works perfectly fine. But see this. Only six left, and the rest are in the, in the museum, so, you know, pretty cool stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and get it. One more thing I just realized is that this entire video kind of looks like crap now, because I've just had the uh, the little vision goggles on that pixelates your screen, so it just makes the video look terrible. Alright, anyways, the last few coins are indeed inside the museum. Nice. Alright, let's see. Three left? Come on. Oh, there were some over here. I didn't even realize that. All right, this is the moment of truth. I finally got all of them. Look at that. Look at that. Let's see. No virtual coins detected. Enjoy these 2,500 bonus coins, which mean nothing to me because I already have a million. And even if I didn't have a million, 2,500 isn't really worth it, but whatever. Um, you are as rich as my virtual uncle, which obviously that's a reference to uh, the epic rich uncle duck. That's pretty cool. Please take this. It's my favorite food. And what is it? And it's just, okay. It's just like a JPEG or something. They just looked it up. They searched on the internet. Uh, I'm joking, but let me go ahead and sell this. All right, this is the spot. Let's go. Let's find it. Also, yeah, like I said, um, you can use this as a guide sort of if you want. Um, but basically, bear should be right here. And let's see how much it sells for. Uh, me hungry. 2,500. That's okay. That's it. I mean, I guess I'll take it. But I mean, I don't know. It just feels underwhelming because I spent like, I think I spent like four hours or something getting this, which is not really worth it compared to other things. So I don't know, man. I don't really think this is worth it, especially if you're a player like me who already has like a million coins. I kind of wish the reward was something that wasn't coins, but it is what it is. Not really a big deal, I guess. It's, it's still fun, sort of. Uh, it gives you something to do. And yeah, with that being said, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, I really want to hit five subscribers. I only have 4.9 or something like that, which is very sad. If you enjoyed, then that's pretty cool. Epic.